Hey, what's up everybody? I'm here to do a very special review. This uh, pepper review is going to be of the Fire Blast. Um, it's a cross created by Nan, an awesome member of Pepper Lovers, Chasing Capsaicin, and Pepper Freaks, and uh, the Pepper Society. Everybody knows them. Well respected. Really generous guy. He asked me um, if I would be interested in, in helping him do a grow out for one of his crosses that he calls uh, the Fire Blast. And here's what they look like. This one is a little sunken in. Some look like that. Some are just a little wrinkly. Some are more kind of like a, some of the Lenzos, just like those. Um, he sent me these when they were still orange, and they, they still kind of are, but they're starting to barely go red. Um, he sent me those six to try, and he also sent me the F2 seeds, so these are F1. So right here, we're about to start to see all the crazy cool phenos and everything. And he even sent me two, a yellow mix and a red mix of some pepper powder, so that's another very nice gesture of them. Um, this F1 seed, or let's see, yeah, these F1 pods, um, the mother was the KS Starscream Red, and he crossed it with the Kangstar Lemon Starburst, one of my favorite, favorite peppers. Um, I actually do have a Kangstar Lemon Starburst growing, um, and a Starscream Red growing. I just did that for the winter is canning. But let's go ahead and cut one of these guys open and see what they look like. Let me get one of these other ones that doesn't have to tell so we get a better look. Mmm. Let's smell it. kind of hard to focus on that. Ah, sorry guys. Move for focusing more on my hand than the pepper. Okay. Well, you kind of see it that the placenta is mostly at the top. But it does kind of extend that webbing of it a little bit down. And because of the cross, you see almost no seeds. Like, I see two seeds on this side. And absolutely no seed on that side. Well, maybe one seed. One seed. So three seeds out of, you know, something pretty small. Um, I, I'm guessing that's because of the certain type of cross, you know, that, uh, that they don't produce a bunch, which, um, is kind of desirable, so you don't have a big mouthful of seeds, like a Thai pepper and stuff, and that's a, one thing that, uh, I know, um, Kangstar is always, like, going for is a little bit of seeds. It's one reason why he loves the Lenzo. And I'm not sure, actually, I thought I might have the Sweet Lenzo, but now I look at other more developed pods, and I might have the hot version. But anyways, let's get into smelling this. Mmm. It does have a little bit of that, um, Chinsonese variety. Chinense. Kind of like that sweet but fruity. I think I'm gonna like this one. Kind of has like that, um, kind of like the way that the Kangstar Lemon Starburst smells a little bit. That sweet and fruity. Doesn't smell like a ton of heat, but it, I'm sure that there's good bite in this. It was the whole pepper, didn't scoop anything out. Not saving nothing. Mmm. 
Mm. Ooh. Now that's got a bite to it. Wow. Mm. Woo. It was oh boy. Mm. Really good flavor. Nice and sweet and fruity. And then bam. Like you can have that beginning heat. And it's kind of there. But at the end, this big pow. Whoo. That's got a good bite. And it... The flavor definitely changes. It might be because it's... Oh. Not fully ripe. Because it's still got a little bit that... A little bit of that earthy kind of taste to it and the heat starts to like change the flavor a lot more in that Ooh. Ooh. didn't eat nothing for dinner yet <clears throat> so it's pepper on an empty stomach this one's gonna be an awesome one to grow out to see on the, like the different phenos that we can get out of it different flavors um different heat levels but that definitely that definitely packed a good wallop <clears throat> and whew, at least the heat went away quick kind of like a like a Thai pepper quick anum kind of like pop in the mouth oh, good burn though so thank you, Nan. Um, I think I'm going to eat these other couple later, probably with some meals. I'll keep them in the fridge until dinner's ready or I decide to eat some with uh, something tomorrow. I am having chicken wings. They'll probably be pretty good. Well, thank you, Nan, and thank you guys for watching this review. You guys have a good one.